What we're going to do today is take a look at a shot that comes up frequently playing straight pool. And the situation is we've got a great key ball here by the side pocket and a good, a good break shot. However, our cue ball position got a little funny and we're below the, the three ball. So we can't really stop it and stop it. And the angle is taking us away from the, the break shot, which is not an ideal situation. Now what a lot of people do is try to go three rails and get into this kind of area here, which is very small. Another option that I see people do is draw it into the corner, spinning two rails out of the corner. Again, they're playing for a very small position. What I like to do is a little different. I like to double the corner, and by that I mean we'll aim to overcut this a little, hitting it thin, hitting the long rail and then the short rail with a lot of inside spin. And the inside spin will walk the cue ball back up the rail toward this long rail. We might catch the rail, um, we might not, but we'll again be on the inside of the 13 ball so that we are staying with a good break shot. And so this is a lot less speed dependent and keeps us in a good position. Let's go to the table and try it. And as you can see, the cue ball hit the long rail, the short rail with inside spin and walked straight up the table, leaving us in good position for a break shot. I hope you liked that video and if you want to see more, visit us at QMasterPoolSchool.com and don't forget to hit the subscribe button.